I found this massive bull shark hunting other sharks and getting dangerously close to surfers at the beach. I called my friend Don and we headed out the next day to search for these sharks. After catching a few Jack Revolves for bait, I put the drone in the sky and immediately found a huge bull shark. Big shark right here, big shark. What do we got, what is this? Oh my gosh, it's a giant Kobe on me. <gasps> oh, it's a big old Kobe on him, bro. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude, this is so sick. It's a nice Kobe, bro. You got him, Don? Yep, he's dead center in the screen. I can't see him. He's dead under the underneath me. Oh, he went right over him. Did Kobe look at it? He didn't even move. The first time he moved, that time he didn't. Is the Kobe or the bull shark? I got the Kobe, dude. I got the Kobe, hey? Eh? Holy moly. Don, keep the drone right there, Don. Grab the uh, grab the gaff. The big Kobe, big Kobe, big Kobe. Oh my gosh, big Kobe. Grab the, grab the gaff. Jake Davis, Davis, turn around. He's on the surface, he's on the surface. Oh, he's jumping. Just, just keep the drone in the air. Don, Don, grab the gaff, grab the gaff, grab the gaff. Just stick him when you can, Don, and rip him the boat as fast as possible, right? Because they come off easy. Ready? Go, go. There you go. Pull them in the boat. Pull them in the boat. Yes! Woo! <laughs> Woo! Heck yeah, dude. Woo! That's what I'm talking about, bro. That's what I'm talking about. Heck yeah, dude. Heck yeah. That's a stud. Over here. I, I figured, I was like, I saw him peel off. I was like, yeah. he peeled off the bull shark. I was like, record. Yeah, yeah. Just because I was like, I'm not going to miss this. Yeah. That was great. Look at that cobia. That's amazing, dude. Well, Sight fished him on a bull shark. How cool was that, dude? Right off the beach. That's epic. So I saw so many bull sharks the other day, and I never saw Kobe on him. It's nice that there was a Kobe on it. I mean, he, uh, he got what he deserved in the box. <laughs> That's where they belong. Hey, Don, do you want to get some black tips first? Yeah. Now, well, I'm using a new hook today. I'm actually really excited about it. So this is the Mustad 39948. It's a 12-aught. How cool is that? It's a big boy. Well, it's, an, it's, it's a thinner hook. So for the boat, for black tips, it's fine. For the beach, I use a heavier gauge hook. You want to use something more like, you know. But for the boat, they're not going to use as much pressure. She's not going to get spooled out here. Now, Don, would you consider that sexy? Well done. That's well sexy. done. Mine, mine never come out quite that sexy. But they're getting better. Don gets a little jealous about the haywire tools. I, I, you know, yeah, listen, I, <laughs> I got to give credit where credit is due. You have mastered it. There we go. Nice, bloody piece of meat. Look at that. It's perfect. So, Don, you're just going to throw it. I'm going to drive up. You're going to throw it off the front. Wash my hands off somehow. Let me ask. I just put the drone back up, and there's a massive bull shark in with the school of black tips. He's moved the entire school. So we, and I, I'll be honest, with, with my experience with, with uh, big sharks feeding on black tips, whenever that's happening, the black tips don't fight at all. So we're gonna catch the bull shark. Don's gonna fight it stand up. And I'm gonna put on number 19 wire. Got a, let's see here. Oh yeah, look at that. That's the perfect bull shark hook right there. Must add uh, 14 knot Demon 3X strong. You good? Yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We spotted the bull shark. He's up ahead. We're going to drag the bait right to him. There he is. Oh, he's big, dude. Look, look what I'm doing. I'm driving the boat, I'm flying the drone, and I'm changing my course based on how the bait is dragging in the water so it gets directly in front of the bull shark. This is hilarious. Don reeled in a little bit. Don reeled in, reeled in. Okay, he's turning this way. Oh, this is fantastic. Okay, uh, stop reeling, stop reeling. Dude, this is it, bro, this is it. Oh boy, here we go. He sees it now, he's on it. Here we go, he's gonna eat it, he's gonna eat it, he's gonna eat it. He's gonna eat it. <gasps> oh. You bum, eat it. Dude, if he doesn't eat it, bro, I'm gonna lose my mind. 
Stop. I think he's going to eat it, bro. He's like scoping it out hard. The black hips all want it too. Everyone's kind of fighting for it. He's, he's very close. What's wrong with you? Just eat the bait. Okay, here he comes. Here he comes. Here he comes. He's got it. He's got it. Oh, 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 my gosh. Oh, my gosh. He got it. Gone. Real tight. Real tight. Real tight. Real tight. We got him. We got him, dude. We got him, dude. Yeah. And we're in. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. We got the big one. Hold up. Put it out of there. Put it out of there. Oh, that took a while, right? What the heck? Dude, real. Real, 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 the perfect size. We need to get some for your boat. Yeah. It's like a little 130. How much should I get? Yeah, I'm gonna get it. It's not enough. I think I could probably go a little more. You're not gonna lose balance? You wanna try? I'm sure. Ready? Go for it. Okay, you're up a little higher. It's yeah. a good amount. That's a good amount of drag. The pickiest shark I've ever seen. He literally came on the bait and turned away from it like five times. I mean, even Don saw it once. Like, Don, give me a watch this. Thanks. Have you ever seen a, oh, he's huge. He's really big. This bull shark is in here feeding on black tip sharks. So this is, just to give you an idea how big this bull shark is. He's eating 60 to 80 pound sharks. That's his diet. And it took us quite some convincing to get him to eat this Jack Creval we cut earlier. And he's right here. I don't think he really knows he's hooked yet. He's really big. He's like, he's like really big. That might be the biggest bull shark of your life, dude. You know that, right? Well, this bull shark might be 500 pounds. He's still taking line. Is he? Yeah. Coming in the back of the boat. We could land him on the beach today, dude. Well, how are we gonna do this? Are you gonna jump in too? I'm gonna have to. Because but... like, yeah, the boat's gonna be. Well, stay in the boat until the last minute, and then you help with the tail rope and uh, yeah. unclip. You know. I'm gonna bump you in a little more, more. Hold on, stand by. I mean, I'm still six feet off the. Hey, this is your chance right here. Set. Go. Good job. Why don't we walk, get a little bit clear of the boat. Yeah. In case he heads south. I'm just trying to get whatever I can so he doesn't get to the boat before we get him in the truck. That's a monster, dude. Are you moving him? I couldn't put the boat on the beach, but the swell was too bad. I'm gonna leave him here so he can breathe till we can get the tail rope. Yeah. Yeah, perfect. Hey, put your camera down. I'm gonna need a hand before he gets pushed up on the beach okay. too far. Yep, we're good. Nice work. Go. Cool. They're tough. He'll start swimming. Well done, man. Huh. Very nice, dude. <laughs> the original plan was well, for all three of us to jump on, but then I realized, you know, we have a boat, and if it turns sideways... I'm it looked really it. flat, and then we saw a couple swells that were definitely like, that's really problematic, especially with an outgoing tide. We, we could have been there for a while. Yeah, and the shark, thank God, that guy was there to help you. Yeah, I, yeah. honestly, and I said you it before we go, I'm like, we're gonna need three guys to like actually land this thing, because <laughs> the camera guy and me he, just he, solo. Davis had to put the camera Davis, down. Davis, I, I gave some stranger, just hold the rod so I could get in there, clip the wire as close as I could get to his mouth. I wasn't gonna play any further than that. We no. didn't have the tail rope. It took three of us to get it back in. We're trying. We literally brought it to the beach because we figured it'd be an easier release than yeah. you know, having a. You know, we couldn't get into the leader well off the boat on a fish that big. So well, we, it's we a cooler it shot for the beach too. That's just well, yeah, yeah, but you know, we did the best we could. He stayed in the trough pretty good. Then he swam off nice and strong. Swim off strong. Yeah, and those things are pretty amazing. 
they're bulletproof, dude. They're he was pretty tough. I mean, but that thing was heavy, dude. I know. I, I pulled the first time. I was thinking it was going to be like a black tip. Like, he oh. He eats like, he eats like 80 pounds. I, I made exactly no progress without <laughs> basically the, it's like, oh, it's the, not moving. the large swell. I mean, his face was sort of underwater enough yeah. uh, to breathe. And Wait, even so he, then, I couldn't move So you move. had water all around him. You couldn't move him. Even with water around it, I couldn't move it. I needed the swell to just pick him up. And, and it was like six inches at a time. It was, yeah, wow. it was tough. That bull shark was trying to eat them. And whenever black tips are being hunted, they don't bite. So, and it took us a while because he wanted to eat the black tips. He kept ignoring our jack. Finally, after like 30 minutes of patience, getting through all the jet skiers and all the nonsense, yeah. the jet skiers, we thought it was over there. We're like, ah, oh, it's gonna yeah, be over. Yeah, exactly. and, and, and I wanna, under, like, it's, it's really hard to single out one fish. There's like yeah. probably 700 black tips here maybe, and one big bull shark. There was two of them uh, towards the end there. But, you're, you know, we're trying to put the bait in one fish's mouth, right? And it's really hard to do that. So we kept dragging the boat, moving the bait. I was flying the drone, driving the boat, trying to position the bait. Finally got it in place, and then he got all skittish. Yeah. Finally ate, though. We got him, dude. I wish I could have been on the beach people. That looked that was, epic. That was pretty epic. That looked that amazing. Epic. Well, Don't ever jump out the boat without the tail rope. <laughs> no. No. Well, you know what? If we had a fourth person on here, that could oh, have yeah. been a lot better. Easy. But the fact that we landed something that big from the beach, yeah. with, with you know, literally by yourself. I mean, Davis yeah. is filming. That's quite an accomplishment. <laughs> big, big school, bro. Big school. There you go, fish on. Is it a big one? Bigger than this morning. It's not huge yet, but. Don's hooked up. Sounds, sounds bigger. How big is it? Oh, yeah, another nice one. What do you want to do with this thing? I think we let him go. Yeah, I think we're good, right? Yeah. That's a bigger fish, right? Oh, this is the same size. There you go. Look at that nice jack of all. They are strong, aren't they? Oh man. <laughs> they pull like a like a freight train. There you go. See you, buddy.